What's up everyone, this is Big Chips Gaming and welcome back to Starfield. We have I not hope done you are satisfied with the quarters available to you. Oh, I've not seen them yet, so shut the hell up. <laughs> um Because of you, Vos Vasco, I forgot what I was saying. So we've uh, not done anything. The uh, the uh, literally only thing that I did since the last episode is come back into the game to do the episode three thumbnail, the picture of Sarah Morgan. Which I'm is at your right service, there. Captain. Stop interrupting me, honestly. I hope that the game isn't too bloody loud because I shouldn't have to shout. Uh, controls, audio, master volume. Let's turn you down to 50. Effects to 50. Uh, in game voices 70. Music's fine. Footsteps of player. Let's do that to 60. Other people's footsteps. Uh, that's fine. Right, that should, let's quick save, that should be honky dory now. Right, let's crack on, what let's talk to you? Sarah. Hello Sarah, how are you doing? So, are you ready to get to work? I am indeed. Or was there something else? Um, that's only time to settle, I still haven't gone to my bloody quarters yet. I'm We're ready. We're going to be doing some old fashioned detective work. The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. That means people can pass them around, not even knowing what they are. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually. But a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. Okay, I have to admit, I'm excited. My first mission, good. A chance to learn more about the United Colonies. Legwork never pays off quite the way you expect. The UC Vanguard... Other people have artifacts. <laughs> Jumping Felt the in. Same way when I started too. There's an electricity in the air when you know you're about to uncover something. But it's not just yeah. that. I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself, and for you to learn more about us. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. Sarah be locked as your follower if you continue. Ah. Oh. Got it, you and me, until we get that artifact. Actually, there's some things I want to do on my own first. What do I get out of this, anyway? We're we'll doing it. head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before, or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Every member of Constellation is their own conscience. Understood? I mean, I'll say yeah for now, but there's going to be a war later. You just know it, and it's probably going to be my fault. <laughs> Understood. Sounds reckless. An organization should have rules. What do you mean? You don't care if I steal, as long as I don't get caught? I mean, Constellation has a roster of members who haven't always been on the right side of their respective society. We're risk takers. Some of us have seen the inside of a jail cell more than once. If you join us, it means you're committed to our mission. In exchange, we give you latitude in your choice of means. Okie dokie. Understood. Good. Let's take a little stroll through New Atlantis, shall we? Okay. I hope Barrett makes it back to us. I know he gets into trouble all the time. Are you going to lead the way? Sort of accepts he'll be fine, but still. Are you talking to me? Because you're looking at me. I think. I th yeah. I don't know. Sorry. <laughs> right. Oh, okay. Come on, I in, Sarah. Hope you are satisfied with the quarters available. I shut up, Vasco. Come on, Sarah, I thought you'd give me the grand tour of this very large city. Can I go up here? Oh, they're not locked anymore. Oh. What do we have here? Cocktail glasses. Sebastian Bank's speech. 
you guys can read it if you want to. I'm not going to. I normally would do reading in games, but I feel like this isn't the game for that. A lot of the story is going to be discovered in my face, not by reading books. Yes, reading the books is a great way of finding out lore. Oh my god. Uh, again, not reading it. I'm taking your sculpture. <laughs> that weighs a little bit too much. Can I... No, I have to go around again like a chump. Oh, cooking station. Oh, okay. Can I make anything? Oh. Bread. Uh, sure. You built that from scratch? Wow. I'm impressed. We did a thing. <laughs> Are you okay, Sarah? You don't, you get a get wet and also burn your feet. Get down from there before you break your neck. You can't die yet. We've just met. <laughs> God, please, I want to see more. I want, I want more glitches, more bugs, please. Nothing game breaking though. I don't want it to destroy my experience. So I can explore all of these rooms. Oh, is that a thing? No. I'm just looking around. Don't necessarily have an agenda right now. I could go and do the quest, which I should really. Yeah, let's go and do the quest. Enough messing around. Let's go. And we're outside. Sweet. Okay. Sarah. Oh my god, Sarah. Do you have to be breathing down my neck like that? Just when you spawn into bigger areas that require a loading screen, could you go somewhere else? She have to be right up my ass. All right, she is following me. It took her a while. So where am I going? What's that? Can I uh, hold F? Press F. Talk to Sarah's contact. Okay. Can I scan Sarah? Sarah Morgan. I don't want to mine her. <laughs> Put that down. Am I going the right way? Am I supposed to go up here? Sarah, I thought you would be leading the way. It's a very pretty game. It is very pretty. I think I'm going the wrong way. Oh yeah, in the last video, didn't... In the, in the last, yeah, video, my last time I played, duh, did I get a jetpack? Non-equipped packs. Constellation pack. Basic boost pack. Oh, yes. Your suit is pro protecting you from environmental damage. Okay, is it equipped? Doesn't seem to be equipped. Is it equipped now? Yes, it is. Can I... Oh, I can't... Your suit is protecting... Ah, oh, whatever. I thought maybe I could glide around. Your watch beeps faster as your suit runs out of protection. But well, I've not heard any beeping yet, so... Alright, so we're supposed to go over there. Oh, my CO2. What is that? Oh, it's a little light. <laughs> Jump! Wee! Oh, yeah, I couldn't have done this the ro I could have done this the longest way Sarah's still coming so how come you don't need to wear a suit and how come you don't have an O2 meter that goes down why Ugh. we are on the right track baby I was born this way 
Oh, another thing. Um, this episode, I have, I'm going to increase the length of these videos. I've set a timer on my watch for an hour and 20 minutes. I want to reduce the amount of editing. I want it to be just neutral, natural, and you guys don't miss anything. Okay. Um, I, yeah, I don't want you guys to miss anything important. I'll, uh, I'll cut out some of the more boring shit. But I feel like this game is, is, is a long game, so it needs to be, have longer episodes. Sarah, good to see you. Who's your friend? Hopefully Constellation's newest member. Thought I'd run through some legwork together. Ah, uh, another space explorer. Hey, you ever think of joining up with the Vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? I like me some credits. Maybe later we have a Constellation business to, to discuss first. Oh, I'd love to join the Vanguard, sign me up. No thanks, I'd rather chat stars than fight wars. What's the Vanguard? United Colonies volunteer fleet. Independent captains enlist, get to use their own ships, and the UC provides them with sustained work and credits. And put in your time, and you're guaranteed UC citizenship and everything that comes with it. Discounts on UC goods and medical services, chance to own a place in New Atlantis. Only way a foreign captain could even dream of seeing those sorts of benefits. So, you want in? Maybe later we have Constellation business to discuss first. I would love to join the Vanguard, sign me up. No thanks. I feel like my choices in this game is going to make a massive impact on the gameplay, on the story. Of course it usually would because it's a Bethesda game, same people that made Fallout and Skyrim. Did they make Skyrim? I think they did. <laughs> sure, money, Excellent. give me that dosh. An orientation on the UC, a knockout on an exam, and a probationary mission. We need to know you'll be able to hack it out there after all. Do well. You'll be out there keeping the peace in no time. Don't forget, John. I need them back after you wrap them in that fancy get-up of yours. No worry, Sarah. I'm not forgetting about you or our little business afterwards. Promise. First things first. Head down to the orientation hall. Get signed up at the registration terminal. System will walk you through the rest. Oh, and if you got a bounty, well, you're going to have to make things right with the UC before we'll let you join. But if you've got any questions, I can get you sorted. Thank you, John. He has the same name as me, only his name is spelt wrong. <laughs> I am going to turn up the co them talking uh, voice. Let's put that up to 90 back right so they should be louder in my ear holes now which is important okay now where do I, oh, I have to talk to you again okay have some questions um we had constellation business to discuss I want to know something specific about the process for joining the Vanguard I'm curious how long have you been with the Vanguard been with the Vanguard commander this building is called mast right what kind of name is that why does the UC need foreign pilots to fly for them? I want to know something specific. I'm sure. Sure thing. What do you want to know? Where do, you, where do I go to get registered? Just hop into the elevator. You want the button for Vanguard Orientation Hall. Register yourself at the terminals in the lobby and the exam system will get you to where you need to go. What kind of work would... What I'll be doing for you guys. Vanguard work is as needed. Murder. When we've got jobs, we'll make them available to you. But the work itself, well, it runs the gamut. Sometimes you might be hunting down hostile ships on behalf of the UC Navy. Or you might be called up to help the science division clean up some invasive species. Hell, we've even been asked to help take on the occasional terramorph. And sometimes we just need cargo support. Not every job's glamorous. The Vanguard only gets called in for the ones where there's a chance of seeing action. Wherever the UC needs us, the Vanguard is there. What the hell's a Terramorph? Well, where's that option to ask? <laughs> Terramorph? Is it an alien? Can you tell me about the exam in this probation probationary mission? 
For the exam, we'll be putting you through a combat flight simulation. Let us see your piloting skills, evaluate how you behave under pressure, all without any risk of you inadvertently getting blown out an airlock. For the probationary mission, though, we'll be sending you out on the job all on your own. The specifics of the mission vary by what's available at the time. But we're not about to ask you to storm a Crimson Fleet base or whatever. At least, not on mission one. More likely, you'll be making a drop-off to some UC citizens in an area that's outside normal naval patrols. There'll be a risk of hostile contacts, but that's far from guaranteed. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to hurt during this, am I? <laughs> the exam's just a simulation. Only way you'll be hurt there is if you trip on your way inside. Now, but I can't oh. promise it'll be risk-free. The UC sends us on jobs because there could be combat. This mission would be no different. Now, if that's a deal breaker, I won't be offended if you walk away. But this is the military. The chance of conflict is kind of in the job description. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for your results. Wasn't there a shit ton more options? What can I do for you, oh. applicant? I'm curious how long have you been with the Vanguard? Oh, blah, blah, blah. This building is called Mass Royal. What kind of name is that? Why does the UC need foreign pilots to fly them? The military sure. used to have a pretty narrow view of where the best pilots came from. In their eyes, it was UC or bust. The creation of the Vanguard was an acknowledgement by the brass that maybe not all the galaxy's greatest pilots went through a UC flight school. So it's the Vanguard's job to find them and get them to fly for us. Okay. I cannot be bothered to ask any more questions. Although I still have to, for God's sake. Do I have to ask every Something single wrong question? Something wrong with the exam? I've not even done the exam yet. I'm going to ask the most important question. Right. Got so wound up bringing you on board, I almost forgot. Oh, I haven't. Come on, John. Let's hear it. Before you try to convince them to join the Marines. All right. Here's what I've got. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system? Which admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. Okay. Uh, we'll talk to him. I'm sure we can make him a good offer for it. A scientific discovery being used as an ornament. The indignity. If he's on patrol, he could be putting our item at risk. Who's this Moora? Wait, what's wrong with the soul system? Um, sure. Soul system is a lot of planets. But a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. Thank you for your help, John. You're welcome. We're off to Sidonia, then. A bar and a spaceport. Sounds like home. Anything you could tell me about Sidonia? Did Moora say where he found this ornament of his? You'll have to ask him. The Vanguard volunteers have retrieval rights if they get into a scrap. Wouldn't be surprised if he found it off of a pirate or something like that. Thank you for your help, Anything for Sarah. UC always takes care of its own. Even the prodigal children. No, oh, brother. Right. Ask about Mora in Sondonia. Okay, I, d I don't have to talk to him anymore. Okay, I've got to go down. Only those on official United Colonies business can access the building. Choose floor. Um, cabinet chambers and Stella's affairs. Defense research, health and human research, uh, central command, lobby, vanguard, orientation hall. I think that's the one I need. Oh. It's the uh, where the blue icon is. That's the floor I need to be on. Mm. <laughs> okay.
Come on, this. Uh, I don't need my torch on right now. It is daylight and it's bright as balls in this room. I wonder if I'll miss New Atlantis when Tony and I leave. No, probably not. Right. Transit car. Spaceport. Let's go and do our first mission. Come out. Come out. I really want to click my fingers, but a lot of you guys would uh, probably pass out. I've flown across <laughs> most of the settled systems in all manners of spacecraft, and yet I still get sick on the gnat. On the gnat? On the gnat? Are you talking about the nurse zombie from Seven Days? Or the little bug from Grounded? <laughs> or me? My name's Nat. <laughs> by Vectera, by Vectera, by Vectera! Oh. I can't believe it! Is it you? Is it really, really you? Uh. Captain of the frontier, bane of the fleet, constellations shining star of stars. Okay. He kind of just pulled me in and I didn't have the option to talk to him or not. Adoring fan. Scavenging. Concealment. Weightlifting. Okay. I, uh, it's me. Then Whatever. the day is truly blessed. Because for a moment, I wasn't sure if you were real or just another hallucination. But now that I know it's you, what are the odds? And to think... I almost went for coffee instead. But I changed my routine for one day, and here you are. It's almost like it was meant to be. Okay. Introvert, you make it sound like I'm famous. Um, I'd much rather fade into the background. It's definitely not. Agreed, this is clearly destiny. Look, I was just minding my own business when you came up to me. You changed your routine. Sure. Fade? Never. A star like yours will never lose its luster. It burns like a supernova, only brighter and covered by insurance. Either way, it's such an honor to meet you. Hey, do you mind if I follow you around? Do you need a sidekick? What am I saying? You're a hero, of course you do. Lead the way. Lead the way. Assign crew. Welcome aboard. Reject. Wait, hold on. I didn't agree to this. Reject. Leave me alone. If you're going to be my psychic, won't you need a costume? Good point. I'll start working on it right away. As soon as I learn how to sew. Until then. Maybe I can be a sidekick in training. Do you have an academy where fans can practice groveling at your feet? If not, I can start one. Welcome you aboard. You won't be disappointed. Okay, so we've done a thing. Manage your crew, review and change their assignments between your ships and outposts. Different crew have different skills which enhance your ship or outposts. Jameson, Alpha Centauri. Change Adoring Fans assignment to Frontier. Sure. Unassigned. Ship, ship. Confirm. Oh, so Sarah is... She does Astrodynamics, Lasers, Leadership and Botany. And he doesn't have much. Assign. Confirm. Alright, okay, so I think I've done it. Current outposts. Okay, back. Alright, so are you following me now? No? Okay, Sarah's going to carry on following me. I really thought he was going to follow me. I'll turn my light on because it's nearly oh, dark. I've always liked that statue. It's beautiful, isn't it? Mm. I wonder what the artist was trying to represent. That's quite nice. That's a nice statue. Uh, wish that bartender at the Security scanners, chemical sniffers. Hmm. 
United Colonies sure isn't taking any chances. And we're back on our ship. Sweet. Sarah's still with us. A Jameson bloke is staying behind, even though I thought he was going to follow me and grovel at my feet. Let's board. Should I warm up the engines? Oh, here he is. You got here very quick. Almost like you teleported. Okay. Can I research anything? Probably can't. Um, weaponry. You are the greatest. Completed, completed, no, completed. Better than the greatest. Okay. I know that's grammatically impossible, but somehow you managed to do it. I like to think of myself as your emotional support. Lovely. We're leaving. Take off. Shield Engine's offline. Firing. Here we go. It's not good. We're locking into orbit now. Right, okay, so we are in space. We've um, got to go to, is it Century? I think it is. Okay, so let's check out, ask about Mora in Sindonia. Sindonia is where we're going. Ship. No, that's not what I want. I want the map. Star map. Let's zoom out. I could explore these planets, but uh, I'm pressing you. Let's jump. Fuel consumption. Oh crap! There's fuel in this. I'm gonna run out. <laughs> How'd you get fuel? What makes fuel? Plants. Uranium. Advised, you are entering United Colony space. Please maintain course and prepare to be scanned. Ah, Mars. You're cleared to land. Enjoy your stay mm. at Sidonia. Am I in uh, the Milky Way? Am I in the our solar system? Is Earth around? I can't see it. All right. What about now? Jupiter, Mars, Saturn, Earth, Ooh. Neptune, Uranus, oh that's cool, Pluto, Titan, oh where's Ganymede, oh I know Ganymede is a, oh wait, there it is. It's one of Jupiter's moons. <laughs> I used to work for a company called Ganymede. Europa. That is pretty cool. Right, so I'm here. Sol. Okay, so how do I... Ship? No, it's not going into ship this one land we are landing on Mars I think <laughs> like touching down on a cloud your landing skills never cease to impress Ooh. when can I upgrade my ship my ship looks ugly get up that's cool are we going to see Ar Arnold Schwarzenegger in this planet? Total Recall, guys. Total Recall. Um, okay. What am I doing? Ask. Okay. Pilot seat. 
they did tell me to land on this planet, right? Why is it asking me to go onto my ship? Huh? Oh, no. We're here. We're going to explore Mars. We're checking out Mars. Hopefully, we can find a better spacesuit. Let's go. Ooh. Okay, there's a very low gravity to be expected in Mars. Oh, hi, Sarah. So, Sarah is following me. You better not nip my kills. Wee. Can I... So, I don't have a jetpack. That sucks. And I'm not using too much CO2 while I'm running. Is there anything over here? Aliens? Bad guys? Matt Damon? Is he here? Oh. Sure, we'll take that. Anything else? Let's turn our light on because it is quite dark. What's that? Nothing. 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 There's nothing here. It really does feel like Mars. What's over here? Oh, there's something over there. Ooh. I don't want to climb it. I uh, don't know what that is. Oh, I saw something over here. Oh. Ah. Which way? Oh, what's this? That looks cool. Nice little space station. Can I loot this, please? Credits, money, thank you. Wrench, screwdriver, vice grip. No thanks. Oh, brown leather jumpsuit. Super cold magnet. Uh, is it this one? Brown leather jumpsuit. Put you on. Cool. I like leather. I feel like Top Gun, Maverick, wherever his name is. I've not actually seen the film. Oh, deserted relay station. Ha, huh, so there's no one here. Level four, level up, let's press P. We have a skill point. Oh yeah, boxing. Wellness. I kind of want to go into combat. Ballistics, pistol, shotgun. Blessed weapons do 10% more damage. Laser weapons, pistols, shotguns. Huh. Science. Med packs, trauma packs, emergency kits restore ten percent. That's pretty good. Geology. Get more common and uncommon inorganic resources from surface objects. Increase grab jump range of jump drives by fifteen percent. Tech, you can now use our ship thrusters. You can attempt to hack advanced locks and two auto attempts can be banked. Unlock ship targeting functionality. I need you. Missile weapons are favored because they can lock onto an enemy ship, but an intimate knowledge of tracking systems can make them even more effective. Unlock ship targeting functionality. We're buying that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh. Okay, so there's a... Oh, I feel light as a feather in this gravity. Bad guys. And I've just alerted them. Fuck. 
<laughs> they saw me through the window. We. Oui. Is that Sarah? I can't tell. They all look the same. Ow. 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 Uh, can I change weapons? Could you get off you. the sodding antennae? Antenna. Yeah, This guy's not very good. Nice. Reload. My health is on just under half. Shoot the wanker. Oh, this is not going well. Reload, please. Sarah! Where the hell's your spacesuit? You're gonna die! We're in space, technically. Mars has a very bad. Oh. Has a very. It doesn't have an atmosphere. <laughs> How did you do that? If I take mine off, I'll die. Do I have any grenades? Okay. And that, my friend, is how we do things on Jameson. On the Jameson? We're not on the Jameson. Jameson is part of the crew. He's a bloke. Okay, Sarah. <laughs> Why don't you ask him out? <laughs> I love being able to hop and skip and jump everywhere. That's pretty sick. Credits. Well, I suppose they're Ooh. not going to need it anymore. Eclectic space helmet. Oh, yes, please. Is there any other? Oh, I want their stuff. There's a couple of more that are angry. Oh, rare item. Drink pack whiskey. Modify Grendel. Okay. This gun is absolutely shit. So is that one. What the hell's that noise? <laughs> What's going on? What's that noise? Is the game broken? Game? Are you broken? Oh. Bourbon. Some alcoholic. Oh shit. Sarah! Currently hidden. What's that sound? Is the game bugging on me? Oh shit, hold on, I'm gonna have to quick save. Quick save, and... Uh, quit, because I think that might have been a bug. <laughs> no, <laughs> I've reloaded the game and it's still doing it. Amp, med pick. That sound is really annoying. Alright, do I have anything that I can swap? So, weapons. Uh, sort by damage. Okay, I've got that equipped already. Alright, so I've not found any better weapons yet. Spacesuit. Oh. Oh. Physical energy. That's quite a cool suit. It makes me look a buff. <laughs> it's worth a lot of money. It's very heavy. Oh. Corrosive. It's, it helps with corrosive. Thermal is higher. Sod it. We're going for it. We're equipping it. I've got two of these. Two of these ones. I can see myself stopping at the ship soon. And back to the very irritating sound. Oh, this gun's sick. Come 
Come at me, bros. Come at me. Sorry. Sorry, Sarah. I didn't mean to shoot you in the leg. Damn it. Sarah, please don't die. You're not wearing any armor. And I died. I died. I'm dead. Oh. Shit. Oh, well, that was very annoying. Ooh, grenade. Do I have any grenades, please? Favourite. And we'll put that onto five. If I use them all, I don't care. I'm pressing five. Really? I died again? Oh, pretty much instantly? Fucking realism. <laughs> oh, okay. It's because I spawned back with not much health. I don't think I should be doing this mission. I'm level 4. These guys are level 5. Uh, this shouldn't be an excuse. So why can't I... How do I throw my grenades? How? I've not done that yet. Throwables. B. Five. Okay, that does the camera. That aims. I'm gonna have to check. I'm gonna have to check the bloody key bindings. Settings. Uh, bindings. Throw grenade. What the fuck's mouse for? Oh, he saw me straight away. What am I doing? Oh, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, this is gonna be annoying. I can't access my grenades. Can you, like, Sarah, move? Alright, we took one of them out. No, you don't. You need to just die. Sarah. Sarah, stop standing right where I'm shooting. <laughs> oh, they're going over there. I'm gonna go down. Don't go down. That's how you die. Nice, I got him. <laughs> Please don't die again. Oh, ow. Oh, for God's sake. I need to figure out how to throw grenades. Oh, there you are. Oh, where are you gone? Ah, don't die. Four. Right, he's down. Another one. Nice, killed him. Good. I'm almost out of ammo for this gun. Alright, we're using our pistol. I have quite a lot of rounds for it, so. Uh, let's quick save. Quick saving. Danger is going down. Now it's caution. Here, right here. I didn't kill him, but now he's dead. Right, there's one more. Hope you're ready to die. Ah, oh, don't die. God, he takes so much health.
Where have you gone? Ow. What level is he? Did I see double digits? He's level 12. Oh. Nice. Woo! <laughs> Fucking hell. Alright, that's all the red dots on the compass gone. Oh my god. Okay, so he was a high level. Berserker coachman. If you're searching them, make it quick. I'll take as long as I want. Uh yeah. Credits. Oh, that's a good amount. Caseless shotguns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, do I get your helmet? This one is better. Oh, but I do like this helmet. Um, nah, I've got to stay. I've got to stay with that one. Oh yeah, what weapons? Did I get any weapons? Uh, where's the guns? There you are. Uh, sort by damage. I keep going past it. Sort by damage. That's still quite high. That is. Oh, this is quite... swap you over for that one that one's quite shite uh, one two I don't think I swapped for God's sake whatever right credits I'm taking all your credits guys honestly any more bodies? Yeah. Side star. Ultra mag. Ooh. Ah, oh, I damaged the computer. I'm sorry. Desktop digiframe. That's cool. We should have stuff like that in real life. But then again, it means we have to charge it every five minutes. We'll charge it every day. That would just be annoying. Anything? No. Nope. Trying to see if there's anything decent to get. Oh. Synapsis Alpha. Med Pack Heart. Yeah. I am going to get my health all the way to the top. Because that seems like the best option. Bathroom. No. Uh, bedrooms. Living quarters. Oh. Milk. <laughs> That's the only thing in that giant case. What was this? Leather pocketware. Huh. Five percent of O2 recovery. Where did that go? I like it. We're wearing it. Ultra mag again. Uh board game. Open, 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 open. Do you have any ammo, any guns, any anything? Oh, what's this? Squall. A powerful combat enhancer, dangerously ad addictive, and rumoured to have been developed by the Crimson Fleet. It does 20% damage for two mm, uh, minutes, 20% movement speed for two minutes. Carrying enough clutter there, or should we find some more? Oh, she's, I think she's telling me that I'm getting over encumbered. Oh. Oh, credits. Oh, that was a good amount of credits. Running while encumbered will quickly drain your oxygen. Uh, great. Can you hold on some of the stuff? Been a long time since I've been to Mars. Soul let's, system. Let's, trade let's gear. see what you've got. Oh. I'm taking that gun. Inventory. Spacesuits. Hang on to them. Deep mining. Why am I still equipped with that? I should have been equipped with that. You can have one of them for now. Go back. Uh, peril. Wear these. I'll take these. Helmets. 
take that. Ammo, aid, notes. Um, let's go to all. And then sort by weight. I keep going past it. Weight. The heaviest thing is this. Do I have modified Grendel? Oh. That seems pretty good. Can I have that instead? Press B. Oh, okay. Bye bye. Um, uh, do I have it equipped? Is it in my? Oh uh, well, okay. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm not too heavy now, so. Where to now? Downstairs? Over here? Because he seemed to be guarding something. I need to find somewhere to sell stuff eventually. Because I'm carrying a lot of stuff on on my on my person and um And on my ship. Oh, 5% that. Oh, yeah, sure. And another one. Blue elbow grease gear. Yeah, sure. And another one. Brown leather jumpsuit. Gravity Plast Merc helmet. Okay. Oh, some credits. 200. Oh, yeah. So many credits. I'm creaming. <laughs> No, nothing, nothing. Okay, so that closes that. Alright, that goes back out into space. Well, Mars. Alright, I'm pretty sure we got everything that we can get whilst being on this level. Let's go down. Please don't be no more bad guys. Space trucker pack. Ooh. Bender machine. Another cooking station. Sarah, please do not stand on this again. It's much nicer than the one that we saw before. Amp. Med. I've already looted that. Sarah, get the bloody hell out of my way. Bye, Sarah. <laughs> Bye, even though this window don't seem to work. Right. Okay, so we're back out in space. Well, Mars, I keep saying that. Okay, well, I'm sure I got everything. I hope. If you guys have done this... If you guys have done this... Uh, settlement before on Mars... And you found some amazing stuff... Please let me know if I have not found it myself. And I'll come back... For a minute, then that looked like a separate thing. <laughs> okay. We. What now? What now? What now? What now? What's over here? Are those solar panels? And jump. There's nothing over here. What is the point in honestly building stuff like this? If you can't do anything with it. It just... It distracts my gauge. My gaze. That's the one I want. Gaze. We. We. Although I love jumping around. It's fun. This gun looks badass. Oh. Credits. Aesthetic manifold. Okay, okay. What's this? Radioactive gas vent. Uh, okay. Oh. Plutonium. I think you need to get rid of some of that gear. Uh, okay, I think plut plutonium is really bloody heavy. Sort by weight. 
Oh, space trucker pack. Basic boost pack. Um, sorry, you're going to have to drop it. Oh. I got another boost pack. It doesn't doesn't make me fly. Typical. Spent for a thousand meters. Sweet, that challenge is coming up. Now I'm cucumbered again. I need to stop carrying shit. What's over here? Why is the why was it telling me to go that way? Now it's switched to my ship. Fat nose, weird. Shit. Okay, so we're back out in space because it told me to, but it seems to want me to go back here. Sure, we'll land there. Oh, okay. Sindonia. I think was on the other side of the planet. Touching down. Fair enough. Okay. We've not been here yet. <laughs> Coming in for a landing. Shh. Exit ship. Hmm, I wonder if the broken spear is still open. It's pretty good. It's the only decent oh, place in town to grab a drink. I ain't got a helmet on. <laughs> I ain't got a helmet on. Oh, did you have it seen by not? Oh, great. <laughs> Remove environmental damage in ships, outposts, and places you can relax and breathe safely. I thought I had that on. It's on now. What? Why was that a problem? And when I come back into my ship, I've got my helmet on. Oh. See, it's doing it again. But my helmet's on. See, it's there. Helmets. Hold on a minute. Oh, shit. What the fuck did I do? Right. That tells me that that's equipped. Sorry, I'm just uh, had to move it. Right. I'm sh suit integrity. What do you mean? Inventory. I've got everything on. I do. I have everything on. Why is it doing that? <laughs> Temperature. Minus temp. Uh, unless I need to have a different suit on. I can't believe I get oh, to God's stand sake. Here. This is too much messing about. I literally just packed everything away. No, not that one. Fuck. Oh, this is frustrating me. Cargo hold. Okay. I've got a lot of suits in my uh, spaceship. <laughs> Minor utility outfit. That's pretty cool. Is there anything? Uh, armor. There's no way that offers the best armor. Most expensive? No. Um, oh, I don't know. Engineering outfit. So we'll take that back. Spacesuits. I've got this fancy Eclipto spacesuit on. Uh, pirate. Peril. 
engineering outfit is on. Why is it doing that? What? Why am I naked? I'm pressing. Thank you. Brown leather jumpsuit. You breathing. Uh, which I literally just had on. Is it still gonna have problems? Yes. Get the fuck up. Where's the hatch? Why is this a problem? You're looking uh, today, Captain. Is the game broken? Try one more time. If not, I'm gonna have to just fucking. Right. I think we've done it. We're not getting hurt anymore. Seriously, that was a pain in the ass. I probably would have. I'm probably going to cut most of that out. <laughs> we. Leeches in the engine. Ow. Leeches on the hull. Multiple leeches in the grab drive. Right, let's go over. Suppose that would explain the brown out. And speak. Is, is Sarah following me? She is not. Well, that's a bloody shame. The underground was a clever way of keeping the city shielded from the harsh Martian. There she is. <laughs> Is the game broken? I can't even see my body. I'm just a floating camera. Sorry? My buddy Mitch keeps mean? asking no if I can uh, help is it this way? Yeah, do you but have any idea how far we've traveled? How much money? Work in the deep mines. That's where we are going to talk to Matey over here. Pardon? Uh, Not everyone. To come to me with their problems. Wait a second. Right. Okay. So, hey, you see that little white, uh, that little red arrow just underneath where it says Beatini? What the fuck is that? <laughs> if it has a, a red arrow, if I take it, then the authorities will get involved and I'll most Excuse likely me. kill me. All right. Come on, Jack. We get a lot of new faces passing through here. Any local rumors? I'm looking for a vanguard named Mo Mo or Moara. What? What's good to drink around here? Any local rumors? I'd like a drink. What's your poison? Um. Dark lager. Bloody how? How much? These are extortionate prices. Um, I'll have a beer teeny. <laughs> I only want one. I'm looking for a gang vanguard name or any local rumors. Uh, just keep been around. Went off on patrol. Hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think it might be time to pour one out to the blackest sea. Oh, uh, we could track him down if you know his patrol route. I'm, I'm not about to leave a brave soldier behind. Let us find him. Space isn't kind to the lost. He's in trouble or worse. Wait, the Black Sea, the Blackest Sea. We're not leaving you anyone behind. I know the feeling, but uh, you just get so used to losing people. Look, nothing more I'd love than to help out a fellow Martian, especially. One that's missing. But <clears throat> he has a tab, and you don't know if he's coming back. It's a lot of credits, okay? I let it slide for a long time because he's a regular. But if I'm out all that money, I got problems. What do you say? Oh, you want me to pay you for information? Ah, oh, you bloody hustler! <laughs> Pay 2,500 credits, fine, I'll settle his tab. Persuade, he could need help, you shouldn't put a price on that. <coughs> Dying. 
Sarah Morgan skipped to the part where you admit you're lying. Ooh. I need a way to make cash then. Got any work? Should I just give him the money and get it over and done with? Yeah. Let me confirm the email. Oh, okay. so much money. Let's talk. Last time he was here, Moera kept yelling about the lady of love. <laughs> Singing songs. All that kind of thing. Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? Oh, fine. We'll make do. Yes. Well, been serving drinks here for over 40 years. Few places can offer that kind of stability. Good for you. Come on, Sarah. Let's go find Buddy Boy. Let's heal too. Come on, hurry up. Take forever to open the bloody door. <laughs> Obviously, it's got to decompress first. <laughs> For a minute then, she looked like she was about to go wingsuit diving, whatever that means. <laughs> She's going to take off. <laughs> Alright, running this way. Uh, should I get my gun out? Where is my gun? There it is. Ooh. This is Sarah's pistol. That would be quite cool to see what sort of damage it does. Back on the ship, was there any fucking point in coming here just to speak to one bloke? Just Now this is one of the things I didn't like much about to be back on board. Red Dead Redemption 2. Marching orders, food orders, is that it took orders. absolutely forever and a day to traverse from one map to the other part of the map to then go back and do the same thing you just done, another map, another town, another city, and then you finally done the quest. That does my head in, and uh, and having a horse to ride on just isn't fast enough. And I had a friend that told me that if you keep playing, you'll eventually lock fast travel. I played for a good 20 hours and still hadn't unlocked fast travel. It wound me up and then I never played it again. <laughs> that doesn't necessarily mean that's going to be the same thing with this game. But it's a relatively a lot more fast paced. I like fast paced. I don't like waiting around. Or, you know, at least give me a, a, a jetpack. Right, uh, take off. Anyway, rant over. <laughs> Not really a rant, just my opinion. Let's put oh. this bird into space. Into space! Sail away, sail away, sail away. Achieving orbit now. Achieving orbit. Okay. So, where to? Am I going to another bloody solar system? I did all that for that. Ugh. Okay, I'm going to Venus. Can I... Venus. Where is it? Mining outpost. Where's Where's the quest? Where's Where's the quest? Go to Venus. Okay, it just says go to Venus. Let's go to the mining outpost. Set course to Venus. Yes. Travel. We're getting the hang of it. Ish. Even though I have no idea what the hell was happening with my inventory and my stuff. And me going out into the Mars atmosphere and almost losing my head. I have no idea. Ooh. I don't they know where our vanguard is. Why are the run zealots out here near Venus? Do you see vanguard mirrorship anywhere? No, no other ship readings in the area. 
and I doubt they'd be so calm if a vanguard had flown by recently. I doubt they know where our vanguard is. Why are sealers out there? No, but I think I see something else that might. There's a UC satellite beacon hovering distressingly close to those Varun ships. If we can get close enough to it. We can distract them with a lightning of faith. I will give you a passage to recite. So we need to get that beacon without being attacked. I'm, I'm opening fire. Those zealots are a threat to the whole system. You worship the great serpent. Well, lucky for us. All right, I'll broadcast out over our comm system. If this works, we should be able to get to that satellite without them caring. Okay. Location discovered. Okay. Pretending to be a religious zealot who believes in a dreadful cosmic entity. Are they enemies? Oh, great serpent. Bless this communion that we may walk in Jinan Varun's footsteps. That he jumped from the soul system out into the beyond and touched your magnificence. That he learned the truth of the shrouding, the coming eternal embrace. That you will reward the promised and cast the accursed into shadow. They speak the litanies of the promised. Let them pass. Be grateful that we observed Jinan Verun's commune with the Great Serpent today. Even such Ooh. a bold recitation will not save you from judgment next Sound time. Sound like a This is Vanguard Moira. To all you see affiliated ships, I'm heading to the Nova Galactic... Have I done it? Yeah, yeah, I know. The whole place Satellite beacon. Am I going to a yet another bloody oh, good. solar system? Earth and everything around it was abandoned a long time ago. And the old star yards are crawling with spacers and other scavengers. It seems that way. This is quite an, this is really nice. Oh, okay. So I was just checking out what we needed to do. And plus, I was trying to take a photo. We have got... Oh, we're going to Earth's moon. I think. Uh, even though the objective is <laughs> over there. Science outpost. Okay. Set course to Luna. Travel. Luna, here we go. Oh. We're doing this thing. Oh, well, that looks absolutely ah, cool. There it is. Nova Galactic Star Yard, still orbiting Earth's moon. This is where the first interstellar ships were made. People still use their modules, even though their Star Yard hasn't been running in forever. Let's see if our god Bora is in that star yard. Forget about finding the artifact. I want to walk on the moon. <laughs> what happened to Earth anyway? Why did we leave it? Uh, it's all ancient history now, but the Earth lost its atmosphere. Oh. It started sputtering out into space. Humanity had about 50 years to evacuate the planet. That's kind of how the United Colonies government started. Managing the exodus. Earth is more or less a dust ball now. You can occasionally find a few remnants of the world we left behind on the surface, but not much. Well. Forget about finding out I want to walk well, on the moon. <laughs> if you want to take a little detour, I admit I wouldn't say no. Just remember, we need to find Vanguard Moara and that artifact when we're done. Oh, most star stations and ships can be docked with allowing you to board them. You will need. I've read that weird. Most star ships and most star stations and ships can be docked with allowing you to board them. You will need to select the ship in your HUD and then fly close enough to, to it so that the dock prompt appears. Okay. Oh my god, the moon. Uh, we're coming in way too fast. <laughs> way too fast. 
It looks a lot further than I thought. Alright, so docking is there. What button do I press to dock? That is the question. Am I not close enough? Am I not close enough? Don't fucking crash into it. <laughs> oh, shield. How the hell do I do this? This is going to be so annoying. Do I need to reverse or something? Am I close enough? I am going the wrong way. How do I do this? close enough stop crashing into it what about now jump drive down oh. come on game fucking tell me oh, how to do this we've lost grab jump oh my god Ugh, so I blew up my ship. Why can't there just be a button that I press when I get about 20 meters away and then the an animation happens? Please don't destroy ship. Oh. <gasps> Dock. That took so fucking long to do. <laughs> Why wasn't there a button prompt? Docking cycle complete. Awesome. Uh, board. We are. Should I warm boarding. up the engines? Oh shit! Okay. Sarah, I have told you time and time again. Stop standing so bloody close to me. <laughs> well, well, this seems pretty cool. We gotta go to Earth after we're done here. Seriously, that is. They, they put Earth in the game. Our solar system is in the game. That's cool. I like that. Uh, I'm gonna leave the episode here, I think. A nice little end note. It'll, this will be a long episode. Um, I'll edit a couple of things here and there. Things that take so long, one, for me to figure out, and two, like loading screens and whatnot. Oh, bye, Sarah. <laughs> I'll meet you there. There could be aliens here or something. There's a dead body right there. Anyway, thank you very much, guys, for watching. If you liked it, please hit that like button. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to stay up to date for more uploads. And please subscribe. It helps the channel out bunches. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Happy gaming!